Three examples in this chapter. First, they lost their spirituality. To be spiritual means that you are filled with the Holy Spirit. And you are following the Holy Spirit. If we were honest with each other tonight, being filled with the Spirit of God is an everyday battle. Even though we are in the family of God, we still battle the flesh. Romans chapter 7 gives us detail about that battle. Often in the church of the Lord Jesus Christ, people fail here. This church could not keep their unity because they had lost their spirituality. Writing to the church of Corinth, la biserică, biserica din Corint. Paul's heart was breaking. Acolo inima lui Pavel se frângea. Over the last couple of years as I have preached to you every year. Pe, în, pe durata ultimilor ani pe care tot am venit și v-am predicat. My heart is broken because of the lack of excitement in your church. Inima mea s-a fost s-a frânt din cauza că am văzut o lipsă a unui entuziasm în biserica dumneavoastră. There was a time when there was a brokenness for lost and dying people. Era un moment când biserica era dornică pentru oamenii pierduți. But there you are at a crossroads. Dar vă aflați la o intersecție. And many churches are at a crossroads. Și multe biserici se află la această răspândă. Paul said to the church at Colossae that we must mortify the deeds of the flesh. How do we get beyond this flesh? We must follow Paul's teaching. He wanted to feed them the meat of the word of God. 1 Peter 2 and 2 says desire the meat of the word of God. 1 Peter 2 and 2 says desire the meat of the word of God. To be spiritual, you must be in God's Word. The more you are in God's Word, the less you'll be in the flesh. It is the Word of God that has been the foundation of this church. It must be the foundation for the future. I encourage you to be in the Word every day. And pray for your church. And pray for the future of your church. But at the same time, we must stay away from selfish things. The Bible said there was jealousy and strife in the church. Some wanted Paul to lead. Some wanted Apollos to lead. And some even Peter. But Paul reminded us there's only one leader of the church. Jesus Christ. It is Jesus who unifies us. If you are looking to men, they will fail you. We must look to Christ. The Bible says in Romans 13 and 13. We are to walk properly and put on Jesus Christ. And make no provisions for the flesh. I wonder if the Lord were writing the history of this church today. And he were to name problems in this church today. Would your name come up? Would you be a part of the problem or the answer? Please be spirit filled. Walk in the spirit and not in the flesh. Galatians 5 and 16. But there's a second example that we find in the Word of God. They not only lost their spirituality, but they lost sight of where they should be going. Listen as our brother reads verses 5 through 9 of that same chapter. Niște slujitori al lui Dumnezeu, prin care ați crezut și fiecare după puterea dată lui de Dumnezeu. Eu am săvit, apoi au dat, 
Dar Dumnezeu a făcut să crească. Așa că nici cel ce sădește, nici cel ce udă, nu sunt nimic. Ci Dumnezeu care face să crească. Cel ce sădește și cel ce udă sunt tot una. Și fiecare își va lua răsplata după o la Lui. Căci noi suntem împreună lucrători cu Dumnezeu. Voi sunteți ogorul lui Dumnezeu, clădirea lui Dumnezeu. They were following servants, but not the Savior. Ei îl urmau pe slujitori și nu îl urmau pe mântuitor. When you lose correct sight in your ministry, când pierzi acea țintă pe cine urmezi în lucrare, you will try to find out which leader to follow. Vei încerca să te lupți să vezi pe care lider să-l urmezi. But let me say something clearly to you. Dar în seara aceasta vreau să vă spun ceva clar. There are many servants, Există mulți slujitori, but only one Savior. dar un singur mântuitor. The Bible says that through these men people heard the gospel. Biblia spune că da, prin acești oameni ceilalți au auzit evanghelia. 2 Corinthians 5 and 20 teaches us. 2 Corinthians 5 cu 20 ne învață asta. That we are ambassadors of Christ. Că noi suntem trimesi în puternicița lui Hristos. Every saved man, woman, boy and girl in this church. Fiecare om mântuit, bărbat, femeie, copil din această biserică. Is to be a servant. Trebuie să fie un slujitor al lui Dumnezeu. Servant serve. Un slujitor slujește. Servant love their master. Slujitor și iubesc stăpânii. Servers do not try to get above their master. Slujitorii încearcă să se ridice deasupra stăpânului. This is God's church. Asta e biserica lui Dumnezeu. You are His servant. Voi sunteți slujitorii lui Dumnezeu. And it is a privilege to serve the Savior. Și este o onoare să-L slujim pe Mântuitor. There should be a joy about coming to church. Trebuie să fie o bucurie pentru a veni la biserică. There should be a joy about finding your next pastor. And I encourage you to follow the Savior. The Bible says in Psalm 127, 1. Unless the Lord builds the house, they don't. They labor in vain who build it. I encourage you to, to look to Jesus again. Colossians 3, 1 and 2 says to set your mind on things above. We cannot live in the past. We have to live in the present. The God who parted the Red Sea is the same God who can see you through this time. The same God who led you out of communism will lead you through this time. But you must look to Him. You must believe in Him. And you must get beyond yourself. And see the Lord Jesus Christ. I want you to know that you have high value to Jesus. Vreau să știți că aveți o mare valoare în ochii lui. And churches that reach their city are the churches that find themselves lifting Jesus very high. Și bisericile care fac lucrul acesta sunt bisericile care îl înalță pe Domnul Isus Hristos. So they lost. They lost when they looked out. They lost this desire to be people who were spirit filled. Din Corinth a pierdut dorința față de oameni din Corinth fiindcă n-a mai fost spiritual. And they were no longer seeing the same things. Și nu mai vedeau aceleași nevoi, aceleași lucruri. Now I want you to notice verses 10 through 15 as our brother reads. Și acum luați aminte la versetele 10 până la 13. Versetele 10 through 15. Până la 15. După Harul Lui Dumnezeu care mi-a fost dat, eu, ca un meșter zidar, 